in South Africa, we have high disease burdens, especially HIV and TB. And compared to genomics, where you can read the DNA, which is like the recipe for building proteins, proteomics tells you what the proteins are actually doing. And it has much more direct relevance for clinical research and for ultimately having positive health impacts on the population. The Ubuntu Summer School idea actually came about by an informal discussion. We were in the States and we were talking about how nice it would be to be in South Africa and do something in terms of training. Less than a year later, here we are. We are a South African summer school, Ubuntu. This is an old African tradition and ideal. We are where we are and who we are because of the community that surrounds us and who is with us, right? From all of that, we, we had really four clear ideals that we wanted the school to have, which was for us to learn, for us to connect, for us to grow, and for us to explore. Stellenbosch. Willkommen in Stellenbosch. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to Stellenbosch, South Africa. Ja, Namugela ist Stellenbosch. La Amuhele Hile. In Stellenbosch. 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 Stellenbosch ist Südafrika. Das ist Südafrika. We wanted to really have a bit of a wow factor. I think the first impact is, is a visual one. Where are you? Just look out right here. I mean, it's just it's just an amazing place. Um, I mean, I don't think I've seen a cloud since I've been here. For us coming from Denmark, it's it's quite special to be here. I think this place is, is firstly magical. It's kind of nice that this is a residential summer school, that everyone is here on site, the instructors and the, and the participants. It's a, a very personal touch. If I was a student, I would have had super envy to be here. I mean, there's some of the most well-established scientists in the world that are attending this. We have 16 facilitators, 10 from academia, and six from industry. And this balance gives us the ability to cover a wide range of topics. The idea of bringing some high-tech life science technology to this country and educating scientists locally is something that appealed to me. The course itself is broken down into very different uh, sections which allow you to learn in different ways. So there are the, the lectures, which obviously you sit and you listen to, but then there's the round tables with the facilitators, the poster sessions, uh, and also more sort of general sessions, sessions with vendors as well, so that the, the people that provide software and, and equipment can give, give you this sort of the, the latest updates on what they're doing. The summer school has been structured in a way that we can cater for various experienced users. So we have track one, which covers more concepts, and track two is more applied examples. So this is for a little bit more advanced users. It's working really, really well. Uh, the, the ability to network here is superior to any other summer school that I've ever been involved in. The summer school has really been able to excite emerging researchers. There's been a lot of interaction with facilitators that I would never have had the opportunity to be able to speak to other than in an international conference, which is very expensive. The proteomics community is just very friendly and welcoming. It's really important to, you know, pass on my knowledge, basically bring the knowledge to a part of the world where I have never been before. I think it was really great to see experts be so vulnerable. People that you don't think you could usually approach actually tell you their stories. It was very um, easy to speak to the facilitators, ask them questions. Some of the people who literally developed the field and published the first papers develop the software I use are present. I hope that the students are going to get a much clearer vision of what proteomic is and will be. I didn't know that there is a proteomics community in here in South Africa. Really nice to meet interesting people and get to know them. It doesn't have to be very formal. Eating, chatting and <laughs> relaxing here, it's much easier this way. If anything, I have potential collaborators for the future. It's been nice to see that I'm not the only one who is struggling and that we can all learn and grow together. There's been some planned activities so that guys can go and see the penguins. I think one of my highlights was, of course, the penguins. <laughs> I really enjoyed the, the tour, just sort of all around Cape Town and see the water, really great views.
I think this program will impact the students on many on many levels. For for a lot of them, I think it is going to be something which is a game changer for their careers, and they'll look back on this week as that was the week that I was in Stellenbosch, and that that was the week that changed my outlook on proteomics in, in particular. Having one workshop doesn't doesn't fix everything but it can really help to integrate the biomedical community for mass spectrometry. What's been really crystal clear to me from this entire week is that we would not be where we are critically without our sponsors. Their sponsorship, their belief in what we're doing have afforded us the, the opportunity to be able to deliver on this event, which I believe has been an excellent event. We think it's a really good initiative and we want it to be supportive, especially you know, a slightly isolated community here in South Africa. We want to be part of the summer school because we wanted to contribute towards research. The reason we chose to sponsor the Ubuntu summer school is because we do believe uh, in the importance of educating the young community. I mean, they obviously will be uh, the next uh, generation of scientists. We at Brooklyn consider that it's extremely important to transfer knowledge uh, between elders and young researchers as well. We've all been uh, student scientists as well. I think it would be a great idea to continue with the summer school here in, in South Africa. Uh, and I would love to come back. I will definitely be back in South Africa. I love it here. Ubuntu philosophy, actually, like, I think we can make a difference if we come together as a proteomics community. Yeah, I think this would be my take-home message. The kinds of opportunities that this has allowed us to have is unmatched. The, the arrangement of this, you would assume uh, the, the international guys are just here to give, but I, I'm convinced now they also got something out of this. Keep it up, it's hard work, I see that, I know it. It's worth it in the long run. If this had happened when I started, I think I would be in a better place. So definitely the summer school needs to be repeated. Oh yeah, I would come back in a heartbeat. The Ubuntu Proteomics Summer School has been fantastic. I don't think that many South Africans recall just how beautiful and rich this country really is. That South Africa has everything it needs. And I look forward to what that future is gonna look like.